Yeah, I love this drink. Will you put my you. Bag I like down. when you like this, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, will you put my bag Daddy, down. I like when you oh, when you're right scrambling here, right and here. scraping for no, 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 shit. No, 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 no. I, got I like that. You know, I'll be practicing. Mr. Lee, will, yeah, I love this drink. Will you put my bag down. I like when you like this, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, will you put my bag Daddy, down. I like Mr. when you oh, when you right scrambling right and scraping. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna go over with that one. Make a wish. Just blow it out. Your birthday every day. Every day is a birthday on Drink Champs. God damn it, I'm in. Where I. Look, Did you look back me? on where I became. Mm. Did you miss me though? Mm. For real, because we, I'm I saying, miss, it seems like a thing. I miss it's his birthday with party, Puff, man. man I but I'm talking about for your birthday. Huh? Why won't you party with me for your birthday, man? I'm, I, yeah, we we party for my birthday before. You came to my party. And, mm. No, but me and you ain't never really party. You know what I'm saying? No, but me and you ain't never really party. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Eyes, 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 brother. Oh, eyes, eyes, uh, eyes. Uh, Eyes, eyes, I understand, I understand. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 yo, okay, so check this out. It's <laughs> me, Tyrese, Ray J, and F. Gary Gray. You know, I'm a type of nigga, I like variety, man. I mm -hmm. like people that's unpredictable. Uh -huh. I, you know what I'm saying? I like different personalities. So I was like, I never knew they would become what they are today. <laughs> But you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but like, you know, mm -hmm. I, that sounded like the type of night I want to have in Vegas. You right. understand what I'm saying? Okay. So, so Tyrese kept now, on talking. This is a fight. This is a Floyd fight, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Tyrese mm -hmm. keep on talking about like how you got to get back for church. And we just like, yo, the night ain't start. You got to get back for church. We in motherfucking <laughs> Vegas, nigga. But like, you can go to church next week. You know what I'm saying? Sending your, send your thing. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing, but we in Vegas. Don't be bringing God into the city. Don't church. bring a God, God into this situation. You know what I'm saying? F. Yeah, Gary Gray is like, nigga, shut the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> then you got um, Ray J. So Ray J is like, just really like, feeling like Ray J right now. You know what I'm saying? We went to um, uh, Florida. We got invited to a, a Puffy party, the New Year's Eve party. Uh -huh. Went to the party, you know. All um, dudes? Yeah, yeah. Nah, it was actually a good party. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. it, it was at, oh, on South Beach, right? Right. So then we, you know, we go to the house, and then, you know, uh, he, he invited us to the house because he wanted to go to the club afterwards, right? I was like, right. okay, cool. So Superhead is with me, you know what I'm saying? Karen, Karen is, is with me, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. Superhead. Yeah, so she takes me, she, you know, she, Puffy calls me outside. He's like, hey, man, you know, the um, that, that girl you you know about the girl you were. I was like, yeah, nigga, I don't, yeah, everybody know about it. You know what I'm saying? What's happening? You know what I'm saying? He's like, uh, you know, that's the devil, man. You know what I'm saying? I was like, what the you mean got, that's the devil? The devil got a pretty mouth. Yeah, and I was like, what you mean that's the devil? <laughs> You know, and then he was like, yeah, man, she, she videotaped you with fingers in the booty. That's a new movie. You know movie. what I'm saying? I was the like, devil what? The sucks like, penis. Hey, yo, what the fuck are you talking oh, about? We rewind, rewind. I heard a penis and a finger in the yeah. ass going, what? She said, he, he, he so told, Puffy tells you he that goes, she. She will videotape you with fingers in the booty. Yeah, and I was like, what the fuck does that mean? Yeah, what, you know what, what does that mean? mean? Confession. So then, so then I go back in the house and I ask her, what the fuck are you talking about? He, he well, you said you're a filmer. No, I, I did ask him. He's just like, whatever. He, he went off and did his thing. And I was, was like, Was he okay. limping? No. <laughs> <laughs> he walked away and the nail fell out of his boot. No, I'm going to clear this shit up. Because I'm not going to have my name. I ain't going to have my name out there crazy oh, like that. Go ahead, go ahead. So then, so then, so then he said, so then she said, oh, uh, I told him what she, he told me. And she was like, oh, she started laughing like a mother. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you later. So then, so then I was like, okay, well, I'm not going to make a big deal of it, whatever. It's only so, so then he's, you know, then, then I guess he's had some prior incident with her that he don't want nobody to know about. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So we get into the truck. He said, let's go to this club. So everybody following the, the, the car. The car is fucking silent. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we get to this club, and then we walk in the back, the back way. It's a VIP lounge. Ain't nobody in there. And then, you know, the club is going. It's all jumping. And then I'm sitting there with, with old girl. So I, so, so then, so then, so then uh, you know, he, he's dealing his business. We go down and get a drink. You know, we sitting there bobbing to the music, and then he say, she point over the corner. It's two dudes kissing. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, the fuck is this? You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay. Then it's girls in the club, too. And then she point another direction. It's another dude over there, like, butt-ass naked. Dancing. Miles worth Ben. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Uh, we take off, man. You know what I'm saying? We lead the club so directly. Saying, I didn't say peace to nobody. So I didn't see gay. nobody. Yeah, it was it was a suspect. Lot of male, a lot of lot, a lot of suspect. Exchanges. The club was you could chalk it up. You could chalk it up to being in Miami or whatever. I never. Okay. 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 Okay.
puffs sitting there. So <laughs> it's kind of, I'm like, damn, this shit is crazy, man. Huh? So what I did was, I would show up to the party in my little, uh, in a little town car. There's town, you know, I grabbed my town car so I could skirt. Puff the SUVs and the road, the Bentleys, the whole night. He get out. I get out too with a camera. The big cannon, like, yo, Puff, I should document this shit, right? <laughs> yo, what's up, Playboy? <laughs> what, what, what you talking about? I said, no, I should get this, man. You, Fonz, with a whole nine. He says, uh, yeah, let him through. Excuse me. So I get the, <laughs> yeah. But at that time, it wasn't like the little camera y'all got in. It was the big intrusive cannon. I had a battery pack. Hold on, man. Let me change the pack. Put my light on here. Do that again, Puff. Do that again. I missed that one. Do that again. Put the pack. So I started following him. So I followed him the whole time. I remember watching Puff at the Beverly Hills Hotel. I'm filming this. And it's a pool party that is ridiculous, man. And I look up and I see Dr. Ruth. I don't know if you know who that is. The, se the sex? The sex lady. <laughs> the sex lady. I see Dr. Ruth. I said, Miss Ruth, could you please come over here? This guy by the name of Sean Peter De Combs. I need you to come meet him. I need this for my camera. Dr. Ruth and Puff at the Beverly Hills Hotel pool dancing. Doing their thing, right? And you know what they're dancing to? Over in the corner, God bless, is Heavy D, Andre Harrell, and they listening to a demo. You know what the demo is? Right. Bum, 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 oh, bum, 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 bum. And then Andre Harrell, run that back, run that back. That's the one right there. That's gonna be the one. You just missed that. The ordering of the champagne, the whole nine. Country, country, get this. If you call me country, I'm gonna take country, get this. So I'm filming it. That's the one. That's the record right there. Run it back. Bum, bum. So Dr. Ruth Puff dancing, right? All of a sudden I get this, and then I, I flip the camera this way, there's the me more and some young dude. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I don't know who do this. So I said, I said, Puff, who that? Oh, that's the young cat. I asked him question. I said, cool. So I, I asked uh, uh, Demi Moore, I said, is it cool if I... She said, sure, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> it was, You know, it was, it was probably a wild night. Said, sure, I'm <laughs> so I'm, I watched when they first, mm. you know, got together. So what happened was, I'm following Puff, following Puff, and his parties were like amazing. We were in Philly one day. I, I fly to Philly. Town car, same business, go up, but Puff say this party, Playboy, this party right here, I see a million and a half dollars. I said, nigga, what? Oh shit, nigga. At least if you in the ATL and a nigga doing drugs in the ATL, the nigga at least excuse himself, go to the bathroom or some shit. Niggas in Hollywood just do the drugs right in front of you and act like ain't shit happened. You in the middle of a goddamn meeting. They, yeah, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the movie with you and then we're gonna, we're gonna go back. <laughs> Nigga, did you know that I can see you? <laughs> Nigga, you right there, it's on your nose. Nigga, what? Motherfuckers be gay in Hollywood, you never fucking expected. They be having these big ass mansion parties, and the mansion party, the whole mansion is a party, and then it's a separate party in the little rooms. I ain't been famous that goddamn long. I'm excited in a motherfucker to be at the mansion party. You be looking in all the goddamn rooms, and you fuck around and look in the raw room and shit. Nick, come here, come here. Is that two niggas kissing? Is one of them niggas Professor Obi? He came out the closet, he came out the closet. Oh my God, a rubber, I moved to New York City. And I lived with Sean Puffy Combs for a year. That's the crazy thing. Now, that yeah. was L.A. Reid's idea, right? We're sending New you over York to City. something called Puffy Flavor Camp. There you go. <laughs> to learn Flavor some... Camp. Yeah, Flavor Camp. Yeah, that's camp. what it was called. And you're going to go to Puff Daddy's. He's gonna In the 90s. Do you understand what that's like? Puffy's place was like just filled with chicks and orging like nonstop, right? No, nah, not really. Come I mean, on. but did I, hey, it was curious. I got a chance to see some things. Yeah, but you were 13. What were you I seeing? I went there to see the lifestyle. 
Right. And, and I saw it. And it was and it was <laughs> but I don't know if I could indulge and understand what I was even looking at. It was it was pretty wild. It was, so nobody it was tried to you know, some woman didn't come along. I didn't and, say that. Okay. I, I didn't but say that. Didn't, <laughs> what I did say is that there were very curious things taking place. Uh huh. And I didn't necessarily understand it. Uh huh. Biggie Smalls was Biggie there. Biggie Smalls was there, Lil Kim, Craig Mack. All you know, these people all are hanging these, around. All, yeah, man, Faith Evans. Jody C, Mary okay? J. Blosh. They ain't know nothing about this shit. Oh. <laughs> I was having a good time. You know what I mean? Does he have you doing any chores? Are you doing dishes at all? I mean, to keep you humble somewhat? Or are you just like, can you stay up till four in the morning with them and party? I mean, I could. I yeah. actually stayed up longer than them. <laughs> and, I, and, what, and do you have money? What's going on? I mean, I had like per diem. Yeah. Uh-huh. I, I had like, you know, what like a, a living. life. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. 14 years old. You're a dad now. Would you ever send your kid to Puffy Camp? You just not gonna tie that loop on that hat and think I'm not gonna say shit. Well, where you skateboard at with the things on your feet, though? Hey, that's a good comeback. <laughs> okay, hey, let's go to the next song. Listen, let's go to the Nigga, get me back. <laughs> we yeah, we um we want to thank you. Come here. Don't don't sit on the bed or nothing. No homo. No, just just don't get close to the bed. Don't get close to the bed. But it's just like yo, we want to thank you for hosting the thing, man. Man, you, you, it's been a pleasure. You didn't have to do it. And you did. No, no, I definitely didn't have to do it. I, I definitely didn't have to. Uh, first and foremost, I'm not getting the bed. Uh, you know, shout out to him and what he did. I'm just gonna, if we can, just let's let's just put the camera a little this way, just so we're not. I don't want my shot to even, like, I don't want it to come close to the bed, at all. I should, I should look like he fresh off a goddamn plane. I should, I should, I should, I should. fresh off the guard stage. That's my brother right here from day one. We used to wake up and, I mean, damn, pause. But we used to wake up and, I mean, damn, pause. But like, check this out. I mean, I mean, back in the days when he was like 10 and I was a little bit older, his older brother, we used to fight over the, over the Frosted Flakes, you know what I'm saying, before Paws was invented, you know what I'm saying, but it's my brother for real, we used to actually wrestle off of the, off of the Frosted Flakes because he used to always get up early with me, and now he's one of the richest stars in the world, and I'm Yo, like, what, what the, the fuck, fuck did Puff just say? Nobody's going to acknowledge this for me. Puff just said we used to wrestle over the Frosted Flakes. And we're streaming live. That was stupid. Listen, that was fucking stupid. Listen, we're having a good time, yo. Are you usher made in the Hey, yo. Fuck that mic. I'm a thug. At the end of the day, nigga, I kill niggas, man. No, listen, at the end of the day, I kill niggas. Everybody know me, man. Listen, in the streets, Diddy's there this weekend. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. Yeah, boy, fan of you, too. Vibrations. So if I make it out tonight. Man, I got so much footage of you doing all kind of shit. <laughs> man, I got all kinds of footage of your ass, man. What the hell you think you can you like a gay rapper. <laughs> Shit, he might be one nowadays. Everybody's a gay rapper except for these niggas, except for you and me, Devon. No, I agree with you on that. Excuse you, are you gay? Shit, you know, okay, he's well, fucked up. I, I know that. Completely. Jesus. Completely fucked up. I can't do it. I don't understand. I know Young Fuck's gay. Hey. <laughs> I know Trey Song sucks dick. I know. <laughs> I know Trey Songz. Trey Songz, yeah, he. I, I've heard about Trey Songz sucking a few dicks in his lifetime. I know, I know, Young Thug sucks on babies, old crusty dick. You niggas keep trying to test me, y'all. Keep trying to test me. Keep trying to see if I'm under the five and shit. But anyway, we yeah, all was on media takeout on World Star and shit. Yeah, Birdman fucked me. He fucked me in the ass for the deal. I'm gonna be real. It's nasty. It's nasty. It's nasty. It's nasty. I even know. I know. I happen to know Diddy fucks boys. It's nasty. It's nasty. That's, man, you keep that shit right over. You have that shit go right past me. It's nasty. It's nasty. He like boy pussy. Mm. He like to play with people's pennies. <laughs> he like to play with people's pennies. Yeah, he do. He like boy pussy. Mm-hmm. I love you, Diddy, but I don't. I don't love you, Diddy. <laughs> I gotta, yeah, that's going viral. Okay. I did that for you, Demon. 
do you have to say to you know any haters or critics of your decisions in that battle to you know do the twerking and you know pre pretending to perform you know uh, fellatio on the microphone uh, i'm not gay you know uh, i'll suck a dick or two but i'm not gay you know um um you know every blue moon uh you know, every blue moon, like, I make sure that I, I, I make sure I'm not gay. You know what I'm saying? I see a nice chick, and I'll be like, ooh, she bad. You know what I'm saying? I see an uh, uh, attractive dude, and I'll be like, that nigga ugly. I don't, I don't like that nigga. You know what I'm saying? And, and I think about it twice, but still. You know what I'm I make sure I'm not gay. I make sure. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it ain't nothing wrong. Like, it ain't nothing wrong. Like, if... Like if if you want to hit a nigga like you know every blue moon like that hey, that ain't gay like you know what I'm saying it's not like long as you long as you long as you fuck twenty two bitches to every nigga you not gay I like bro you gotta read it it's in the gay book like in the gay book you had to fuck more men than girls to be legitimately gay so like. If you fuck 23 girls and one gay nigga per year, you not gay. Like, you not in the gay category. Like, you still a straight man. So, I keep it to one nigga per year minimum. Like, I'm good. If, if you could choose just one guy to fit that uh, quota, who would it be? You had Diddy for 2014. Oh, one guy. Because I, I got to get one guy for 2015. I'm gonna have to go with. I'm gonna have to go with Ti. I've been feeling like I've been feeling this caramel shit. Like you know what I mean? Like that caramel shit. Like, like when I first seen Rubber Band Man, like I was like, Yo, this nigga, who this nigga with the little thing on his lip? Yo, yo, like, yo, that my nigga. You see this nigga? Yo, and he kind of short, my nigga. And I know he like to do it because he got a lot of kids. Like, so I know T.I. like a freak. Like An attorney is asking Georgia's attorney general to file criminal charges against rapper T.I. and his wife, singer Tiny. Natisha Lance is combing through the allegations and the charges the attorney is seeking. The accusations are dark. Forced drugging, kidnapping, rape, and intimidation. And the accused are some of the most well-known figures in Atlanta. Clifford Harris Jr., known as T.I., and his wife, Tamika Harris, known as Tiny. A New York-based attorney says more than 30 women contacted him from various states, accusing the rapper and his wife of abuse. The disturbing allegations span more than 15 years, going back to 2006.